This is Bangladesh, one of the fastest growing countries in the entire world. It is a nation that is continuing to emerge as a global economic powerhouse as it registers robust economic growth. In 1990, it had a nominal GDP of only 31 billion US dollars, but by 2020, it had experienced tremendous growth after its GDP was estimated to be worth over 330 billion dollars. But the country's most exciting stories lie in its future state and the infrastructure developments that would support its transition to becoming an economic powerhouse. Before we move on, don't forget to leave us a like and hit that subscribe button for more. Bangladesh is an economy that has grown tremendously in the past and will continue to do so in the future. Its nominal GDP is expected to reach a trillion dollars by the 2030s, which makes the next decade Bangladesh's time to become one of Asia's leading economies. This decade will also be a time for society to become a fully digitalized, tech-savvy population. And all of these will be possible because of the infrastructure that is supporting the nation. The country of Bangladesh is well on its way to doing so. It has planned and constructed world-class infrastructure developments across the land. From mega-projects of transportation systems to power-generating energy projects, fascinating financial and business districts are just among the many other master plans that would embark the country to be a stronger future. The most notable infrastructural schemes to know, however, are mostly in the transit systems. There are currently quite a number of railway projects the country is focusing on, and most of these are estimated to be worth upwards of billions of dollars. The largest agenda is yet to be seen, but is the so-called dhaka Chittagong Railway, an $11 billion, 227-kilometer high-speed rail line. If it would ever be completed in the future, it would be the country's most amazing mega-project it has ever constructed, as making it requires a lot of money and expertise. The following expensive endeavors are the likes of the Dhaka Subway, an $8 billion, 258-kilometer underground rail network that would connect the various places of the capital of Bangladesh. Dhaka MRT lines, which is also similar to the subways by having its own rail network system, and finally, a staggering $2.5 billion airport expansion to the Hazrat Shah Jalal International Airport. Furthermore, there will also be the construction of bridges and road links, such as the Padma Bridge and the Dhaka Elevated Expressway. Other than the transportation agendas, the next biggest endeavors taking shape are the energy projects, one of which is estimated to be worth billions of dollars as well. The Rupert nuclear power plant is the biggest amongst the two, as it has a construction budget of $12.6 billion. It will also be the country's first ever nuclear power plant. Nuclear power plants are, however, notorious for having dangerous incidents in the past. However, this one will be treated with special hands, as the building safety measures are helped by Russians. Entertainment will also be a key factor in helping the country's economy. This is through a future sports entertainment complex known as the Sheikh Hasina International Cricket Stadium, which will be one of the largest stadiums around the world. A deep seaport project known as the Matabari Deep Seaport will be its master plan to enter the sea trade stronger. This will be the country's first ever deep seaport and is expected to have an annual capacity of 1.1 million TEUs. Along with these mega projects, there will also be a mega township which is locally known as the Purbachal, and it will be Bangladesh's next central financial and business district. It is a township that has been allocated tens of billions of dollars to construct a society filled with innovation. The entire project will consist of several super tall skyscrapers, one of which reported to be a 142 floor, 734 meter building called the Legacy Tower. These infrastructure plans will help position the economy of Bangladesh as a competitive economic nation in the future. As the country advances further, the structure of the country is slowly shifting away from a traditional type of living to a more modern and technology-driven society. These are very common for emerging countries like Bangladesh, where the former of having an agricultural-based economy slowly turns into a service and manufacturing-oriented economy. 
Moreover, public spending and investments are not the only ones driving the economy. Private corporations and institutions are also doing their part and are doing far more in investing than the public. As the nation slowly proceeds with these, Connectedness and innovation will eventually bring prosperity to not only its people, but to the rest of the world.